Hi, I'm Dr. Steve Hoffman. I'm here from uh, Houston at the Johnson Space Center. This is my uh, fourth visit to Devon Island over the past uh, dozen years or so. And this year I'm up here uh, representing an office from the Johnson Space Center that's interested in the kinds of uh, activities that we'd be doing on other planetary surfaces with uh, both humans and uh, robots. Uh, we're looking at three different experiments this year. One of them is uh, a traverse, a long traverse, using the same uh, vehicles that the humans would use, but without humans on board. So they'd have to be guided from Earth. And we've been looking at different uh, techniques uh, for guiding those vehicles from uh, relatively long distances and uh, trying to find a safe path to follow so they can get from uh, where they started from to where the crews will need them for future missions. Uh, the second experiment involves looking at different uh, science opportunities that would happen along one of these traverses. Uh, we will undoubtedly come across different objects or different uh, opportunities that the scientists would like to stop and investigate. So we're looking at ways of uh, accommodating that as we move the, the vehicles across the surface. And then the, the last experiment, which is where we're at right now, is uh, looking at uh, places where we could land the human lander uh, safely and uh, using the robots that will be present or likely to be present on the surface to verify that we have in fact picked a, a safe place to land. Uh, for those purposes, we really want to find something that's flat and, and free of rocks or other sort of obstructions. And as you can see behind me, it's uh, the, the team at, at Johnson Space Center that picked this spot did a pretty good job. So we'll take all the, the data we've been collecting here over the past uh, several days back to Houston and, uh, and share it with the people that did the plans initially. And uh, we'll make some assessments about how well we did and then change, um, change our approaches, change our, our means for selecting these routes and these landing spots accordingly.